Okay, this is the Toby's Auto Parts Radiator to suit the Subaru Impreza WRX G2 S44 Sports Wagon from the 10th of 2000 to the 8th of 2005. Okay, fits the 2.5 litre. Also suits the Impreza G2 4 door from the 9th of 2005 to the 9th of 2008. The 5 door from the same and the G3 4 door from the 9th of 2008 onwards. Okay, it suits the 2 litre. Four and five door without the bleed pipe. Okay, we'll get to that in a second. This also fits the Subaru Liberty four door and wagon from the 11th of 98 to the 8th of 2003, the third generation, two and 2.5 litre, and the Outback wagon from the 11th of 98 to the 6th of 2003, third generation, two and 2.5 litre. Okay, for both the Liberty and the Outback, there is a three litre which has a different radiator, so this is specifically for the two and 2.5 litre in the Liberty and the Outback. Okay, and it's for the 2.5 litre in the G2 Impreza and the 2 litre G3 Impreza. Okay, the main thing just to check straight away would be driver's side top tank corner. Okay, as you can see, this type here doesn't have a breather pipe, and some do. Okay, so in some uh, Subarus, that would be the first thing to check would be this top corner here, whether it has a breather pipe or doesn't have a breather pipe. Okay, I'll just explain this plastic wrapping for you. It has two main reasons. The first main reason being that it keeps the radiator protected from any sorts of contaminants while it's in storage, and it also protects it while it's being transported as well. So from any sort of transit damage, it keeps it protected as well. So they're the two main reasons why we have the plastic wrapping. Okay, I'll just run through some of the features of this radiator. As you can see across your top tank here, starting over on the passenger side, that's where you'll find your cap, okay, coming out on a slight angle from the tank. And there's that small overflow hose as well pointing towards the passenger side of the vehicle. Okay, two round mounting points at the very top. You've also got one, two, three, four, five, six fixings across the top there as well. See towards the middle you've got your top hose. Okay. We come down to the bottom tank. Over here at the passenger side, you've got your bottom hose, okay, there's also one, two, three, four band fixing along the bottom there, okay, we've also got two fixings at the front as well, okay, over here at the driver's side on the bottom tank, okay, you've got your drain on the side, and just underneath the drain, you've got your connection for your sensor, okay, well I've got it here too, you can see, automatic transmission oil cooler okay this is suitable for both manual and automatic transmissions if you have a, a manual transmission these can be very easily removed and it just remains unused it's completely safe and doesn't cause any problems whatsoever okay if you've got the automatic transmission you can see we supply the fittings that are needed as well with the radiator okay to show this would be the front of the vehicle so if you're standing in front of the vehicle looking into the engine bay this is the view you would have. Okay, You can see over here on the passenger side of the vehicle is where you'll have the cap with your breather hose pointing towards the passenger side. Towards the middle you've got your top hose. Okay, You can also see the one, two, three, four, five, six fixings that will go along the front as well. And the two round mounting points as well. Okay, Just with the caps, we always recommend that when you buy a new radiator you also get a new cap. And the main reason for this being that your existing cap might not be an exact fit for the new radiator. It could also have rust or other sorts of corrosion which are stopping it from working properly. So we always recommend that when you get a new radiator, you also get a brand new cap, and that way we can guarantee it will be a perfect fit. You can also see over at the side here too, we've got the Toby's Auto Pass stamp on there. And that's just to show you that this has come from our factory, and it is a quality part. I'll just go through the dimensions of the core with you. When you're measuring the core, you're going from inside to inside. Okay. Inside to inside is yeah, 680 millimeters. Okay. When you're doing the height, again, it's from inside to inside. and that's 340 millimetres. Okay. As you 
as you can see on here, the quality of the aluminium that we use is very high. It's a very top grade aluminium, which means that your tubes and your bins are very strong and can dissipate the heat very quickly. Okay, we also use a very high grade, top quality plastic for our top and bottom tanks, and it is very strong. Okay, and lastly, we've got the copper fittings as well on the automatic transmission oil cooler, which Unlike the aluminium type fittings, these won't uh, burr or thread or damage as easily. Okay, it's for all these reasons that we do a three year, 60,000 kilometer warranty on all our radiators. So hopefully this video has been a help for you to find the radiator that you need for your vehicle. If you have any more questions or inquiries, please check on our site or give us a phone call on 1300 178 178. Thank you.